how important is this offseason? That that's the the logical question. You you got Mitchell. There might be a major tweak or shift in the roster, and y- you got to find the head coach. I mean, you got to get pretty much all of those right. Yeah, and that's uh, you know, it's a very it's funny because nationally we're not hearing much about the Cavs offseason, but uh, locally, I think people are understanding that yeah this is this is pretty huge because you've got three big things uh working right now number one obviously is a donovan mitchell thing i i think that's even bigger than the coaching hire because you can hire a great coach if donovan mitchell leaves well then you're starting from scratch again you know so i think number one's donovan mitchell number two obviously the coach presuming that donovan mitchell does resign as everybody is optimistic and confident that he will do uh or or sign that extension then you know you got to find a coach who's going to bring out the best mitchell you don't have to worry about but going to bring out the best in mobley allen and the the guys around them uh you know the karis leverts and isaac okoros and and and, and, you know some of those other guys george yang that that you want to contribute even more next season so that's the number two thing the number three thing is obviously you know, Isaac Okoro is a restricted free agent. I would say that all these things are tied. Isaac Okoro is a restricted free agent. Evan Mobley can can sign a longer deal. And then, of course, you may have to deal with the Darius Garland trade, which all of a sudden, after you make a coaching hire and sign Donovan Mitchell, this becomes your number one priority, could potentially be trading Darius Garland. So, uh, yeah, it could be it could be as crazy an offseason as you think. Now, the other thing I've heard, and and, you know, one thing we have to remember when it comes to trade, uh, Dave, is you have until February to to make one of those. So I don't know that they'll be real desperate to make a trade uh, before the season, unless it does involve Darius Garland, because you don't want to go into the season with a guy who who doesn't want to be there. 